The remains of Mrs. Iko Hensha Athaware have been committed to Mother Earth on Tuesday at the Koi Vault Cemetery, Lagos. A brief funeral service was held at the redeemed Christian Church of God, the Temple of God Parish, Ikoi. Pastor Christian Ike represented Pastor Tunde Bakari of the Citadel Community Church at the service. He admonished everyone that death was an inevitable end and a debt that must be paid by all. Plus TV Africa's correspondent Love Ikukoyedeko was there and brought back this report. The funeral service was well attended with family, friends and well-wishers. That came to be their final farewell to Mrs. Iko Henshaw Arthur Warre as she journeyed home to the great beyond. It was also a moment of tributes from the children, colleagues, close associates and acquaintances. There are not enough words to describe her impact on my life, my brother's life and I'm sure everyone else is here. She was a goddess and now she's going to be with God. It just makes sense. So there's nothing to be sad about, to be honest. This is a glorious occasion. Her unrivaled commitment, doggedness, and ever ready stance to assist and mentor upcoming officers like us. She was an example of professional decency with integrity. Pastor Christian Ike, in his exhortation, admonished the congregation to live a life of service to God and humanity. He described late Mrs. Ike Henshaw Arthur Warre as a committed Christian whose legacies remain indelible in the sands of time. IQ with IQ. She has such a resounding testimony. She's somebody who not just embraced Christ, but she... She's so devoted in everything that has to do with the kingdom. The remains were finally committed to Mother Earth at the Ikoi Cemetery. <laughs> Mr. Fola Athawara is the bereaved husband. With emotions, he spoke to Plus TV News on what his late wife represented. I had hoped that when she retired next year, we would have more time to spend together because before that, you know, being a federal worker, she was always on posting and so on and so forth. Wanting to expect a new son, but I will hold on to the memories. You just have to find the grace to persevere and just keep pushing through because she'd want nothing short. She'd want nothing less out of each and every one of her loved ones, really. She would want nothing less. Her spirit lives on, I know that. I can feel her presence very strongly right now. She's at peace, which is very important. She was her authentic self. She was unapologetic about who she was, and that is what I take away from her life. Oh, she's left such a legacy we are proud of, that she served this nation for 34 years plus and with untainted record. That goes to show, and I believe that her children are going to run with that legacy. It's a legacy we are proud of. One thing that's evidence in everything said about late Mrs. Iko, Henshaw Arthur Warre, is that she lived an impactful life. From Lagos, love Ikuku Uyeduku for Plus TV, Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.